Okay, let's try this again. Welcome back, one and all, to South Park the Fractured Hall. I am the Amazing Butthole, and last time, we went on a yaoi hunt and got all 40 pieces of yaoi in South Park. Now, we're gonna go turn them all in, get our reward, and go torture Cartman. Who's up for torturing a fat anti Semitic bastard? Kevin. Let's go, kitties. I got porn to watch. That's... Piss off. I'm not in the mood. I got shit to do. Craig's house. Explosive Squadron Kun Boizu. It looks like something it looks like Persona 5. I'm so glad I met someone else who appreciates Japanese culture. Sure. But no selfie. Okay. Let me tell you about our generous rollover minutes policy. Not interested. I'm supposed to ever get a new background for the phone. Yeah, you can just look at these whenever you want. Why does Kyle look like a girl? Everyone else is pretty on point, but not Kyle for some reason. Hey, I'm just imagining things. God, I feel like I've been waiting three years for this. Oh, not again. See you, new kid. I don't know what's going on with my recording. Give me one second, again. Three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time cards. Sorry for that cut. I lowered the bit rate, so it's not gonna look as refined. I can already notice a drastic drop in the quality. But I don't I don't know why it's just staggering out. I'm gonna try rebooting my computer after I finish recording and see if that helps me out any. Yeah, let's go torture Cartman. What is wrong with you, Cass? I am not your enemy! You're gonna talk, Cartman. New kid, you're going to have to make Cartman talk. What? What are you gonna do with that? You guys are wasting your time. I'm the Coon. Torture doesn't work against me, remember? So, so what? I, I just have to watch you eat? Is that it? I'm, I'm not afraid. Ooh, chili dog. This is a waste of time. We should be going after the bad guy. See? It, it doesn't even phase me. Uh, burrito. Guys, I really wish we could just wrap this up. No! 
I'll sack you. Not, no, not even a little bit. I can gobble those farts up. See? Yum, 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 yum. How about some nice asparagus and cabbage? That asparagus is sure gonna make your fart smell bad. Clear out that arcade, nice. Dude, fuck up. Social media has enslaved us all. Excellent. Glad to have you with us, Nick. I have a feeling this crap business isn't over, new kid. Ow, let's do it again. Sure, but Lord, we make a pretty good team. Sweet. I already know. I already know. I got one. I don't remember if I did you or not. Yep. But now I didn't. Put some filters on it to make us pop. Okay. Let's get up to that genetics lab. Yeah, you know, it seems lowering the bit rate helped me out. All it does is not it, it just makes the colors look a little less crisp. Still HD. I'm the f f fastest kid in town. I could have taken like seven million selfies by now, like literally. Oh, you know awesome. you can always just go fuck yourself, Jimmy. This new Freedom Pals crew sounds like quite an accomplished group of superheroes. Resistance to D-Mobile's nationwide coverage is futile! Where am I going? Apparently further up? I can't grant you unlimited D-Chat, human! I'm not interested. Yeah, up here. Everyone's here. All right, the new kid's here. 
Come on, you kid. Can I help you? Yeah, hi. We signed up for the tour. Ah, yes, the night tour, correct? Uh, yeah, we're a little early. Well, I'm afraid for safety purposes, the tours are only offered from 10 p.m. to midnight. What, just to be extra spooky? It'll be worth the wait, my <laughs> friends. See you tonight. Shit. Now what do we do? We'll just have to wait. We can't afford to let anyone else go in or out of this gate. I agree. We're just gonna have to wait here till nighttime. Okay, how far away is that? Uh, about six hours. All right, just wait six hours and we're good to go. Long now. Still about six hours. Okay, cool. This sure is gonna be exciting in six hours. Shut up, Scott. Did anybody bring any uh, snacks or anything? Yeah, we should have brought snacks. Oh, God, okay, how long now? Right around six hours still. Jesus, fuck. You know, kid, you still have yet to tap the full potential of your time-bending ass. 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 Something that could enhance your ability could possibly make time pass more quickly. Quickly. You see that AC fan over there? On a hard right miss. There behind you, over by the gate. On the left side, can't miss it. Yeah, I'm looking right at it. If you fart into that fan, the oscillation of the gas will filter it through the expansion valve, mixing it with the pressurized refrigerant inside the condenser coils. Coils. Don't question if that makes any sense, kid. Just fart in the fan. Go on. I'll fire it up for you right now. Some young people interested in genetic engineering, huh? Wonderful, please come in. Oh, hello. Oh, there's more. Hello, sir. My, my, there's a lot of you. Timmy! Well, I'm so pleased that you children are interested in genetic engineering. Genetic science began as a simple question. Can a monkey be made to have four asses instead of one? Why? The answer was yes. And now we've been able to give more asses to pigs, horses, everything you can imagine. Yes, little boy. How does that help? Oh, you're one of the cynics, huh? Well, meet me over here for the tour and I'll show you how. Come on, don't be shy. We don't want to miss the four asses gorilla feeding. Okay. Please have a seat. You ever play that video game Half-Life? Okay, here we go. I've only ever played the demo. Here you can see our greenhouse. Genetic engineering is helpful to grow larger tomatoes, onions, cucumbers. Fruits and vegetables with more asses means more nutrition for people all around the planet. What good does that do? Oh, more you food. Final thumpers are all alike. Don't play God, you'll pay for it. <laughs> Let's continue up <laughs> to the second level, shall we? However, that does actually have more food, so that, that does help. I'll give that I'll give them that much credit. Another benefit of genetic science, of course, is combining animals. Like these donkey apes, bunny fish, oh, squirrel donkeys, and more. Once we put more asses on these, we will truly be benefiting science. Can you please explain how that benefits science at all? What's your name, little boy? Super Craig. You see, Super Craig. Once we know how to do things to animals, we can hopefully apply them to mankind. You think having more asses is impossible? I tell you it's not. You see, genetic engineering is not just for animals and veggies. We are working towards helping people as well. Here you can see genetic mutations of my dead son. Most people don't remember that I once had a young child named Terrence. Oh yeah, I remember that kid. I was wondering whatever happened to him. Terrence was killed tragically in town when some kids were playing around with a relic belonging to Barbara Streisand. Oh, jeez, I think that was us. So, 
you're doing this all as a way to I don't know about that son? episode. I don't, they don't find anything well, on it. Of course not. I'm trying to give his dead body more asses so he can finally rest in peace. Now let's continue on to the fourth floor. Oh, fuck. Well, here we are. The top floor of the building and the end of our tour. What are these? These horrible, monstrous mistakes of science. Our new benefactor has asked that we genetically alter some of the local sixth graders and make them stronger and crazier. Okay, okay. Why the fuck would you do that? How do you mean? Why the fuck? Would you make genetically enhanced sixth graders? Calm down, Super Craig. How do you think we pay for all this? We have financial donors. Our latest benefactor has asked for this army of mutated sixth graders to protect his altered cats. What altered cats? Oh, right over this way. A wealthy benefactor named Mr. Connor has donated money to have stray cats enhanced with more asses. Our company can add asses to things at very competitive rates. Problem is that cats seem to become really aggressive when given more asses. They've proven to be quite deadly. Then why would you bring a bunch of kids up here? Look, there's nothing to worry about. This entire facility has a very complex security grid. Huh, that's never happened before. Oh shit, someone shut down the security grid. What do you mean? <laughs> oh, freedom pass. What are you doing, fat ass? So, you figured out my little plan, huh, Freedom Path? Think you can stop me? Oh, I have someone here who'd like to say hello, new kid. Go on, talk. Guys! Guys, it's me, the kid! Will you knock it off? Listen to me! Don't make any deals with this piece of garbage! I don't think they can hear you. That's enough out of you, kid. You've been a real pain in my ass, new kid. You should have known not to mess with Mitch Connor. Where the fuck are you? Mr. Connor, if you shut down the security grid, then everyone in this building is going to die. What? Sorry, Doc. Sometimes sacrifices have to be made for the greater good of the city. The greater good. <laughs> Many assed cats. Let's do this. Let's dance. I mean, not literally, because I don't dance. Let, let's punch. I'm sorry, kids, but we're probably all going to die here. <laughs> Son of a bitch, that hurts! These things are so bitey and scratchy! <laughs> That's going to leave some scars. Super Craig believes in you, so believe in him. All right, I'll try. I taught him everything he knows. I suppose I should comment, but honestly, I can't even do it. Those kitties look kind of cute, but they're not. <laughs> I'm gonna skip your turn there. One less turn for the bad guys. Go get him, Tiger! Oh, amazing! We may actually survive. No, maybe if I just press buttons randomly. Get off that uh -oh, panel before here's I Ivy. kill you. More test subjects. Curious. I hit that button three times and it did three different things. Stop pressing buttons. Fuck you, kitty.
I feel I should mention that my test subjects have a crazed hunger for human flesh. Might have something to do with the ass-adding process. Well done, but I'm afraid you're still hopelessly out-assed. Easy, boy. My turn. Let's do the yaoi attack. Now, you can see the yaoi I assume you've all had your TDAP vaccination. I really should. I did the same thing as last time, and the result was indeed the same. Fascinating. Uh oh, it appears I've released more test subjects. Can someone get him off the panel, please? Ha, I'm all thumbs today. Definitely should not have hit that button. Yeah, I saw that coming. And they're defeated. And I got seven dollars out of that. My poor creatures. We must escape the lab. Maybe. Maybe we can go through some of the larger exhibits. This way, children. You know, oh. I'm not sure this panel actually opens the door. Mutant sixth graders are on the loose. This was definitely not supposed to happen. <laughs> School so dumb. Parents are dumb. Yeah, don't you stupid. Oh, Jesus. It's okay. We'll be safe in the tour tram. Oh, the tour tram is offline. Somebody's going to have to get to the CPU and hit the override switch. Where's the CPU? Down on the third level. Oh, it was silly to put it there, wasn't it? So somebody has to walk down to the third level and flip the switch? One, two, three, not it! Not it! Not, not it! it. Not, not, it. it. <laughs> not it! Sorry, new kid, but it really should be you anyway. Yeah, if you think about it, this is all kind of your fault. How is this my fault? You know what? I'm done. I'm done. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on South Park, the Fractured Butthole, as I, the Amazing Butthole. You know, it's just, it's just, it's just I'm just done. <laughs>